There's a journey all men ought to experience at some point or another. A voyage of self-discovery. A crusade for authentic expression. This is a story about a beard. My beard. As a young teen, I was unfortunate to land in the cohort of people that were plagued with acne. I may not have had the most riveting social life, but what I lacked in confidence I made up for with an abundance of pimples. The strict dress code in my school at the time didn't tolerate the sporting of such phenomena as beards and mustaches, so I was implored to add insult to injury and shave my already fragile skin on a weekly basis. When I graduated and went to college, I found myself in what seemed to be a parallel reality, surrounded by a new brand of men unafraid to strut their stuff in the facial hair department. And it was then, around my 19th birthday, that I decided to investigate the untapped potential of growing my own beard. In addition to virtually ending my relationship with acne, it revealed to me two things. One, growing a beard is a journey. It changes you. And also, my mustache is white. Weird, I know. We've been hot, cold, sad, happy. We've been to lakes, waterfalls, oceans, caves, libraries. We've been stuck in stairwells. We've traveled in cars, planes, boats, buses, walking, cycling, hitchhiking. We did an arabesque one time. We've eaten carrots. We've even been chased by a herd of cows. They're after me. We played music, fallen in love, learned how to make baba ganoush, climbed mountains, walked far in streets, and met so many beautiful people together. This beard and I have had a fun and interesting life. It's been thick and it's been thin. And it's always been there for me.